What's up guys, this is Potato Bob from zfrag.engine.com and today we are going to talk a bit of Toribash about the modes and the rules. So first we're gonna start with the modes. So the way to do that is you press escape, you go in setup, then you go in modes, and you have your list of modes on the side. And then uh, yes of course you uh, press for new game because this is going to start all over and it's, this is what you want. So we're going to go with uh, any mode there, type 1, let's go. And uh, normally this mode have uh, them specific eight rules. Here you see the duration of the match. Um, if you press escape again and you go in game rules, you can see the rules here. Here you have match frames, so that's the duration of the match. So if I want a really long match, I could go with 1000, which is really a long match. Turn frames, that's the duration of your move when you press space. So if you want uh, to, uh, uh, to, to, to be able to make uh, more fluid movements, you'll have to move it to something lesser, like tree. Uh, number of flags, I think that's the spawn points. Dismember po uh, dismemberment, uh, this is if you want the people to get uh, all in pieces all over the place. Fracture. You have DQ, I'm going to take everything out to have a, a special fight there. Uh, let's move this to 30 because I, I don't want to show you the tree. And gauge distance, that's the distance that we start from each other. So higher it is, uh, uh, farther you will be. So let's put it at 300. Dismember threshold over here. That's for um, your character actually. If you want to... If you want a punch to destroy your opponent, you put it at uh, something lesser, like 5, not 100. If you put it at 800, you'll be hyper resistant. 8000, that's it. There you go, 800. Reaction time, that's the time when you uh, press ti a space that your character movement uh, will be. Let's say it's gonna be very fast if you put the reaction time at uh, about 1. If you put it at uh, 45, it's gonna be a really slow movement speed. So there we go with that, let's see what it gives. So as you see, I went here from uh, 30 frame, that's what I set up earlier, and uh, it's still uh, 970 to go back, so if I press again, press again, it's going by 30 frame every single time. You can switch that and make uh, different different uh, frames every uh, every single time you'll press space by going and set up again game rules, putting this there. Then you can change it. Put twenty next one, ten next one, five next one, one one. All right. Let's see this. So here you see. 30 frames the next round, 20 the one after it, 10, 5, and my moves are getting shorter every single round. As you can see now I'm at one frame, you see the, mo the, the speed I'm going, now I'm, it's back to 20, I don't know why, 10, 5, okay it's going everything, uh, it's doing everything back again. So now I'm at one frame again. So you can see the difference right there. There's a lot of modes, and uh, most of them have swords. Not those kind of swords that I want to show you. I'd like to show you, show you, show you. Let's say a mace, just to. Oh my god, that's not it either. Uh, sword and shield, alright? So, for those modes, to give you a tip, as you can see, you start up with a weapon in your hands, but this weapon, when you look at your ghost, you see my ghost over there, he's falling, and he's dropping the sword and the shield, so if you want to prevent that, what I suggest to you is press C, which will hold all your joints, so your character is not falling apart. 
then you press V to hold down your stuff with you. So then I'm going to be equipping my gear and using it well, as you can see. If I press V again, I'm going to be throwing it instead. So it's to you to choose what you're doing with that. It can be very useful if you like go like this and release your weapon on your enemy like that. But it didn't work actually. <laughs> oh, GG. So that's about it for today. It was Potato Bob from zfrag.engine.com. I wish you a good time on Terry Bash and keep bashing. See ya.